hello guys welcome to my channel i want to show you guys how to make the vault you have a six yard of bed sheet and you divide it into three that's the three yard three yards in the first followed by the fiber and followed by the other three yard of bed sheet and you make your design that you want to do any design of your choice as for me i'm making box as you can see the tiny lines of my box and i'll pin it very well i pin it very well you pin it very well yes pin it very well and as you're pinning it make sure that you adjust the bed sheet under make sure you draw it after you pin it you go to your machine and follow the lines that you draft so that is it's very important for you to pin it in order for it's not to be moving while you are sewing it and as you're sewing it make sure you're arranging it you're putting your hand under to arrange it before matching it <coughs> you arrange put it down and up to make it look very clean and neat make it very clean and neat this is how it's going to look like when you arrange it it will not fall and as, as you're sewing it will be moving the pins in order for it to balance well because the fiber is moving it shifts it's shifting so you have to do it and when you are getting to the middle you have to be folding it like this to get close to the next line that you're supposed to sew you arrange it like this so it will be easier for you the only option you have so even if you are using a manual by the time you fold it like this it will be easy for you to pass through the tiny hole in between the machine because it's fiber once you put it there it's going to shrink and you push it so this is how you're going to do you fold it close to the next line and you sew it please make sure you are arranging it very well arrange it properly you'll be arranging it properly in order to avoid it folding and this is our final result as you can see i'm done designing <coughs> so i'm going to trim the edges and after i trim the edges i'm going to pipe the edges i can decide to use the best sheet you can decide to the best sheet or you use a different material to make it look good so i'm using a different material this is three yeah three inches I just cut three inches long and I join it to be very long because I'll be needing a lot of it for the board four side and this is how I'm going to pipe it please if you have not subscribed do well to subscribe so when I drop any video you'll be notified and click the notification button so that you'll be notified whenever I post a video and this is how I'm going to pipe it when you sew it in the other way you turn it to the side arrange it well please do well to subscribe to my channel so that you will not be missed out this is how it goes i can see how good it is it looks this is how you do it you arrange it well and so i'm done with the other line i'm with the next line this is how you do it this is how you do it okay this is the second one i'm doing so this side has to be very neat I pass I cut it I added extra two inches to fold it in in order not to have a rough edges. This is how yes you can see good. Uh -huh. That's that's why I folded it. As you can see. You arrange it well. That's how it's going to do that's how you're going to do the other side too. The both side. The four edges this is how you're going to do it. This is beautiful. How are you seeing it? Okay, we are done. This is a duvet. We are done with the duvet, as you can see. And these are the draw pillows. I'm going to drop videos on how I did the draw pillows. Please do well to subscribe and click the notification button so that when I drop the other videos, you see them. How I made the draw pillows. All together with the draw pillows. This is a big pillows this is four of it this is a complete set of duvet and this one you don't, you don't need to pull for the inner one because most people have pillows already when they buy it they just need to insert their pillows inside and this is the best sheet this is three yard 
and the duvet is six yard making nine yard while the pillows all the pillows i make use of three yard also so all in all you need 12 yard for a set of duvet please don't forget you need 12 yard for a set of duvet plus the plain material you need your fiber board for the filling and this is it we are done how do you say it guys isn't this beautiful and lovely please do well subscribe so you see how i made the true pillows thank you for watching thank you for coming thank you for coming to my channel thank you how beautiful oh god this is beautiful thank you for watching please do well to subscribe thank you and make sure you practice what you learned thank you